fuck I tag you in this shit. Hmm. How the fuck I tag you? All right, you know. How the tag you in this shit? I can't. The little man right there. The one that say bring you in the video. Kinda what's up, man? I'm steady calling you, man. What's going on, Joe? Don't tell me we on our 2011 shit, man. 2012 shit. Hmm. What's up, Joe? What's the little man? Is that ain't it right there? This one? Mm-hmm. That ain't it. Nah, that's a uh invite friends to watch. What about this one? They say Maybe I guess. I'm about the little plus sign. A little plus sign. No, I didn't. <laughs> Ask somebody on that. Now look, now look. This, this, this the thing. Hold on. Fuck. I, this, this, this guy here. Yeah. Hold on. I'm gonna tag a minute. Guy, Fifty Frost is a vegan. He looking at my food all crazy. Hold on, let me show this. That shit blurry as fuck, hold on. You know what I'm saying? He looking at my little shit all crazy. You know what I'm saying? I got chicken, you know, season. Sweet baby rays. You know what I'm saying? Ketchup, you know, something slight. Let me see what he got over here. He looking at my shit all crazy, hold on. I don't know what's wrong with him. It's a, what, 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 all right, now tell the what is this? <laughs> this is a falafel wrap. A what? A falafel wrap. A falafel wrap? <laughs> Never heard of it. <laughs> Never heard of a falafel wrap. What are the ingredients in this falafel wrap? A falafel wrap is just chickpeas. It's chickpeas, fried chickpeas. You got to elaborate, because... Hey, you know what chickpeas is, niggas? Chickpeas? Fried chickpeas? Yeah, they grind, they grind up the chickpeas and they fry them. <laughs> and what's this? And this? Oh, that's oyster mushroom tacos. Mushrooms taste just like chicken. Now look, this the thing, right? That's it. Look good. It ain't gonna lie, it look good. But what y'all prefer? The real deal, the real chicken with the steak fries and the sweet baby rays, or the vegan stuff. It look good. I don't. It don't That's not the question. What's the question then? You prefer to live. <laughs> or what? Ain't no the other opposite. <laughs> ain't, no, ain't no other house. What you mean? We still here. We living. I've been eating on I've been eating this chicken and, and and fries with sweet baby rays for a long this, time. This is life. This my food is alive. You know what I'm saying? What they what my food was alive. What you mean by your food was alive? Explain this to me, cause it's, I don't It's still alive. Are you eating? That gotta be animal cruelty or something. What's the matter? Your food still alive. Hold on. Good plan. That's when my second first. Or second second right there. Yeah. It'd be it'd be decent. It'd be decent. It'd be decent. It'd be decent. It'll get me back because I'll be hungry, but I ain't never picking no vegan food that was no real chicken. That's 
I can't. Can name? What can name, man? Cuz, what you on, man? Shit, chilling, man. Trying to get this man with the program, man. He going too far with this vegan stuff, man. Everybody is. I ain't gonna lie. Hey, I'm crazy. I ain't going. I ain't going too far yet. Mm hmm. The next, the next step is fully alkaline vegan. If it ain't alkaline, if it's, if it's acidic, I ain't fucking with it. And then after that, the next step after that, it's gonna fuck your head up. <laughs> I hear it already fucked up. No food at all. What? <laughs> <laughs> Only herbs, water, and sun gazing. Cuz, you hear this man over here, cuz? <laughs> the man said he done went from eating regular food to being a vegetarian to being a vegan. He talked about the next step is not eating no food. No, alkaline vegan first, fully alkaline. Then, only sun gazing, herbs, and water. Man, cry. I'm eating fried chicken. I got a long way to go to get to that one. It's a sun, 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 gay. Yeah, you see, you, you know, sun, sun, um, sunrise, sundown. You get your energy from the sun. You you gaze at the sun. Only a certain, like, from the first hour of the sunrise and the first. It's <laughs> <laughs> bad, crazy in the motherfucker, man. The man a fucking nut. The man cried. What the fuck game that the sun got to do with eating is what I want to know. Bro, we, Break this down because I want... We, we carbon-based people. We we are sun people. The sun gives us our energy. Just like, just like do plants eat. The plants get their energy. They get their life from the sun. Mm -hmm. We do the same thing. We just don't realize it. Hmm. If I told you, it's it's been it's been. Oh no, cuz. Solo, solo. I know you know something about this, solo, cuz. Man, say so you finna stop eating food, man. He gonna live off. Our... Son. <laughs> if that man ain't, <laughs> I'm gonna have to reevaluate this shit. I always like to see these cowboys. <laughs> what the fuck you talking about? <laughs> I look good, man. I don't know. I'm, I'm trying. To, I'm trying to figure this out for real. Hell no. I'm gonna lie. This should look good. It look good, mm -mm. but it don't taste like that. It don't taste like that chicken with that sweet baked rice on it. Mm -mm. <laughs> Check, what's up? What's wrong? Mm -hmm. There's no people that did it though. I'll tell you, if I would you believe me if I told you it's people that went a whole year, 365 days without eating. And then what happened? That's the question. What you mean? Learn. Go get me some more they, fries. They didn't lose any weight. They actually gained weight. They became more in tune. <laughs> Why you bring this stuff like, bro? Hold on, hold on. I ain't losing no weight. <laughs> Mm -mm. 
Yeah, it's probably too early, man. We need more people to tune in because I need to know. This sound savage. This man said he finna stop eating food. He say somebody went 365 days without eating and they didn't lose no weight. Come on, G. You ain't finna eat. This man ain't finna be telling me no anything. Uh, uh, uh. Yo, it, your, um, your iron levels go up to the point where wintertime, you ain't even gonna need no coat. Chicago winner. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> oh man, we gotta do some interviews on this. We got the Doctor Frost. This was that. This was stuff Doctor Savior was talking about. Well, you want another level for him? Yeah, this is um, uh, you know, Doctor Savy is a uh, he was a herbalist. He was um, he was a uh, um. He was a healer, and he did it through herbs and alkaline-based foods. Right. So this is another form of healing, but this is based off of sun gazing, and it's more metaphysical than anything. Right. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Look at these comments. <laughs> So you want to hold another level than Dr. Same, huh? <laughs> Look, there you go. <laughs> uh -huh. There you go. I'm trying to figure out because a lot of people fuck with Dr. Same, man. Now this this is um I would say yes or no, because Dr. Say be sun gays and all of that too. Um But this goes back to like how we originally, you know what I'm saying, got our energy. Yeah, his mind got frostbite, man. The man crazy, savage. You hear me? The man is The man said, bro, hold on. The man went from, he was a um, vegetarian. Couple months later, and probably a year later, I caught the man. He's my he a vegan now. Okay, cool. I understand all that, but you know I'm in the joint eating all type of bullshit. Like he talking about he a vegan. I'm like, cool, that sounds decent. But I get out, bro, and I see how this man living, bro. This man starving himself, bro. <laughs> With this vegan shit, this shit ain't right. So that, all right, cool. You a vegan now, but e boy, what's up? You a vegan now, that's cool, but now the man talking about the next step is an alkaline something. But forget that, that's cool. It ain't as worse as, it ain't as bad as he talking about he finna stop eating food. The man said he gonna eventually stop eating food and live off the sun like a plant. <laughs> this man crazy, bro. This man over here crazy. I'm eating good chicken, fries with the barbecue, sweet baby rays. <laughs> This man over here eating guacamole stuff. The man a nut. The man a real life nut, bro. This man look regular, but now I'm seeing. This man, he gonna live off the sun. He gonna gaze at the sun for an hour a day. Not an hour, it ain't gonna, but it's within a certain, within an hour time frame between sun up and in an hour time frame between sun down, you can gaze at the sun. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you gotta make sure you got. Your shoes off, your socks off. You plant your feet on the soil. You know what I'm saying? You look this nigga funny. <laughs> oh, nah, shit. it ain't funny, G. It ain't funny. <laughs> it ain't funny. Because this might be how we need to live, bro. It, it is. But it's like... I'm going to tell you why, right? Mm -hmm. Because this shit finna fuck, this finna fuck your viewers up right now. <laughs> <laughs> because this really finna fuck you up, right? So right now... It's uh, it's energies, different energies. The the sun is releasing different energies to the uh to the earth, right? And the more you in tune with the earth in your natural state, and that's by sun gazing, opening your pineal gland, um, 
alkaline base foods, you'll be ready for that shift or that energy shift. It's gonna be a lot of people going crazy. It's gonna be um it's like it's gonna be more and more natural disasters. Um and so basically like the sun is doing a lot of solar flares. You, you all can look it up too. So right now I definitely am. Solar flares, they're becoming more and more frequent. And every time those solar flares happen, and the sun bursting out these these different energies, it does something different to the earth. Like it might cause a tsunami here, it might cause an earthquake, it might cause different shit, right? Wow. <laughs> so, so, so um, it's going to get to a point where it's going to be even more and more and more, right? Mm -hmm. And if you're not prepared for those energies, because what it's basically doing is like, it's like a car. It's like, it's like a car, like when, you know, a battery dead, you uh -huh. got to try to jumpstart it, right? Right. So basically the sun is almost jumpstarting the earth and it's going to put us in another dimension, mm. right? It's fuck, this is going to fuck people up, right? Right. <clears throat> and so if you're not ready to go in that, that next that next dimension, you're going to be left here. And the only way you can go in that next dimension is by eating clean, you know, meditating, um, sun gazing, um, different things like that, right? Right. What you read? What you find out about this shit, bro? It's in the Bible, um, and you know I, I'm not, I'm not a religious person mm -hmm. at all. Right. I just know how to really read the Bible. You know what I'm saying? When you know the Bible, it's um. Now, which which Bible is this? Because you know they got different Bibles, so they do, right? So I need to know where you're getting this information from, so I can take it from you. You don't need to be reading none of this stuff that got you talking about you finna <laughs> stop eating food, bro. <laughs> So, so look, so basically, right. Man, this, <clears throat> the, the, you uh, just tuned in. This nigga say, he finna, he was a, he he was, went to a vegetarian, to a vegan. Now he finna do some alkaline shit where he just, but the man say eventually he finna just stop eating food. And live off the sun. Am I? That, that's that's. I'm correct the way I'm interpreting this, right? Yeah, I'm looking at. I'm looking. No, at I'm it. just making sure. I'm just making sure that I'm interpreting that you say <laughs> you finna live off the sun, <laughs> no food. Yeah, yeah. Only herbs and only herbs and water. And then when you look at the sun and it give you energy, you got to put your feet in the soil. Mm -hmm. This shit too deep for me, my nigga. This shit too deep for me. Look not. No, I'm trying to tell you, like. That, <laughs> Next, I could picture you saying you ain't even finna wear no clothes. You finna stop wearing clothes. What the fuck? If you talk about going out the Bible, out of me, they ain't wear no clothes. If you going out to how the Bible is. I'm not, I'm not talking about I'm not talking about doing that. Okay, okay. I'm not gonna walk around here. I'm not finna be walking around here ass naked. Man, you talking like you losing it, like. <laughs> I just ate good chicken, fried chicken, seasoned with Larry's. Good chicken seasoned with Larry's. See, shit, wasn't that? Man, I got to take it, bro. So you hear me? I got to take it, bro. Oh, this shit getting too deep. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> he told him to take the book down. <laughs> <laughs> Anyone I see, anything I see, I'm taking it. <laughs> they say we fuck you up. <laughs> This alkaline, whatever, this this vegan food, they got this man eating G to fuck this man up on everything. I ain't even know this shit was this is. Uh, <laughs> this shit oh, shit. He looking at my fried chicken and my fries like, he over there looking at me, I'm busting my shit down, he looking at me crazy and shit. <laughs> like, what's he yo? <laughs> this man over here eating plants and shit. I don't know what the fuck. That shit crazy. Hold on, I'm gonna let him finish explaining this uh this other shit. Uh 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh yeah, man. They they interested. Uh, <laughs> somebody was finna ask you a question. Phoebe said she was finna ask you something about it. You might be on or something. Who? So who? somebody, Phoebe, Phoebe, she from the hood. What's she? She got it. She best said that. So yeah. Oh shit. Oh. Down and drop a shit. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, Ty go fast. Talk about the the plants frying my brain. <laughs> frying. <sighs> Let me see here. Uh, see now that that's a good question. E boy say what I'm gonna do in the winter. That's a good question. See right now where we at? You know in Chicago. This is not ideal conditions. You know what I'm saying? The sun gaze, because we only got like three months. So shit, I'm gonna have to move. You know what I'm saying? Fuck Chicago for the move. I know bro is vegetarian, vegan, but the way he carry it, that's good, but no food at all, bro. <laughs> yeah, that's 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 down the line though. That ain't, you know what I'm saying? That ain't gonna that's not overnight. You gotta build your way up to that. Mm-hmm. But what was I talking about? You read this in you read this in the Bible. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, so so about about the energies coming to the earth. So right, you gotta understand. People read the Bible, they be reading that shit wrong. The Bible is not about Jesus or a a mysterious God in the sky. No, that shit is not. That shit dead. Ain't no Jesus coming back. Ain't no God in the sky. God is in you. The book, you ask a Christian, you ask a Christian, what does Bible mean? They gonna tell you some silly ass shit like basic basic instructions before leaving earth. That is not what Bible means. The Bible, if you if you go back, you had to look in the etymology dictionary. Bible, going back to Greek, is biblios heliotech. And then if you translate it back to Hebrew, <coughs> It's um, um, Biblios Hebraic. Or he, I don't know how to pronounce that shit, but Biblios Hebraic, right? And that means uh, Book of the Sun. Not S-O-N, but S-U-N, right? So everything is about the sun's journey through the galaxy. The 12 constellations is the 12, or the 12 zodiacs. Is twelve is the twelve constellations. So each position of the, the, the sun is in when he when the sun is in these different um, zodiacs or constellations, it gives the Earth different energies and different things happen with us within you know what I'm saying with when the sun is positioned different. So right now we in the awakening. I believe we in Aquarius, right? Um, so the sun is positioned in Aquarius and right now it's giving off more and more energies, waking up, really waking our people up. She, what'd she say? Oh, did she say I'm a Jehovah witness? I don't, I don't subscribe to any Bro, religion. what the fuck is this though? That's Dandelion T. <laughs> <laughs> Dandelion T. <laughs> this is what I'm saying, G. Like, what the fuck I've been at? Never heard of it. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm gonna let him finish, dog. Y'all, <laughs> <laughs> she crazy, bro. Is she crazy? Let me let the man finish, G. Ain't fucking with you. I ain't fucking with it, G. So I gotta right. eat my chicken. So when you look, when you look, when you look in the Bible, at certain things, right? When you look at, like, for instance. The books, the book of the Bible starts in Aries, right? And Aries is the ram, right? So when they talk about Abraham, really all of these things in the Bible, they stole from ancient texts, Sumerian texts, Egyptian texts, um, all different, you know what I'm saying, African texts. So really, Abraham was really... Abu Ram, right? Which is the ram. So 
they really just changed up the stories to make it seem like it's some mystical God in the sky and Jesus going to come back if you good and save everybody. You know what I'm saying? But this nigga been punishing us for 12,000 years. This nigga's not coming back. Um, but, but, okay. Oh, that's cool. So, what this got to do with you stop eating food? So, the food is the big, the biggest part, right? The food that we eating is poisoning us, right? Even the, even the vegan food? No, nah, well, they poisoning the vegan food. So, this this way it's getting to, right? Right. They, they got a patent on all of the seeds. Mm -hmm. They growing, they growing, they, you only allowed to grow and sell and trade with these certain seeds that they got a patent on. We're not allowed to, or we're not in a position where we can grow um, the right foods for our bodies because our chemical makeup is different from the Europeans' makeup. You know what I'm saying? They could eat all this bullshit because they was living in the caves. Right. You know what I'm saying? We can't eat this shit. Um, it doesn't it doesn't fit out our, our body and that's why niggas is dropping dead left and right cancer at 26 um all different types of diseases so now it's to the point where it's like almost like a genocide because they they fucking with they put gmos they they making hybrid vegetables they fucking with all the food the meat everything they fucking you know what i'm saying you ain't supposed to be um consuming dairy or anything like that anyway right. um but they definitely fucking with that so it's to a point where if you can't get the right um, fruits and vegetables for you, um, then you got to figure something out. You know what I'm saying? Because the rest of the shit is poison. All of the shit is poison. But listen, listen, listen. Right, right. So if all of this stuff is poison, even this vegan food you eat, then why you just ain't eat regular food then? You might as well just be eating regular food, bro. You just now, said. I didn't say all of the food, but they... I didn't say all of the food is poison. Or maybe... I, let me rephrase it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not not all of the food is poison right now. But they keep taking steps and steps and steps towards making everything we consume poison. Right, right. You sound crazy, though, don't you? I know. Ah, she said you a Jehovah's Witness. <laughs> <laughs> he said you gonna pass out trying to eat leaves and shit. They funny as hell. <laughs> no food at all. This nigga crazy the motherfucker. I gotta catch up on these. Yeah, so anyway, man. I don't know. I'm thugging. I'm thugging. I'm thugging, I'm, I'm thugging for life. You feel me? Fuck vegetarian. Fuck the vegan shit. I'm thugging for life. Hair roots. You feel me? Sundays from McDonald's, like it's certain shit I got to have, bro. You know what I'm saying? Bro, McDonald's. Sundays, <clears throat> caramel Sunday, chocolate Sunday, Wendy's Frosties. I got to do the dairy. I gotta have cheese in my egg. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? You talking about all dairy, right? Yeah, I'm talking about dairy, chicken, all that shit. Does dairy fuck your stomach up when you eat it? Mm, probably. It. That's your body telling you. And you ain't supposed to be eating that shit. Bro, 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 bro. Hold on, let me let me finish this, right? Let me, let me tell you this, right? Mm -hmm. Milk. What, what, when when baby cows are born, right. what does a baby cow, what, the calf, what does a calf drink? It drinks milk right. from his mother, right right? right? right, right, A baby horse drinks milk from his mother, right? Right. Horses don't drink cow milk. Monkeys don't drink cow milk. Lambs it. don't drink cow milk. Right. right? When you a baby, right? All this making sense. I know you're going with this. When you a this. baby. I know you're going with this. Your mother, right, is producing her body. Milk is producing her body that you can drink it up to a certain point. After a certain point, Uncle Raymond's with the you cannot got consume it. Hmm? I, I no, nah, I said Uncle Remus. Got to have it, bro. Got to have it. After a certain point, your body cannot break down milk. It's only made for you to get. But what, what, what point is that? Because I've been drinking milk. It's it's. I've been drinking milk. I, I believe it's like I, I don't know when. Whenever women, whenever your mother stops producing it, that's when you're not supposed to drink it no more. Right. You know what I'm saying? So and 
if and if the woman is not in a natural alkaline state, then that milk that she's producing is lethal to the baby too. That's why they tell you certain things like they tell women don't they got a long list of what you can't eat when you're pregnant. And one is fish. Because fish are sponges for mercury. Right? They in the water, they eat they eat smaller fish, smaller fish, and all of that builds up mercury. <laughs> mercury is poison to the human body. Right? That's why they tell you don't don't consume mercury. They tell right, you right. But all of these things regularly, they say, oh, go ahead and eat it. But no, nah, it's poison on a regular basis, too. Because you're just going to build it up in your body. And then, and then cancer happens, all types of other diseases. But it's people, what I'm saying is, it's plenty of people that be eating and drinking and smoking, doing <clears throat> crack and all that shit. They be living for a long time. Yeah, your mind is powerful. If, if, it's like a placebo effect. It's like, if you don't believe nothing wrong with you, nothing going to be wrong with you. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's like people who, it's people who, Go they they'll go to the doctor find out that they got cancer and then two weeks later they'll die. You know what I'm saying? Right. Well, they done had cancer for 10, 15 years, but your mind is so powerful. Now imagine if you decalcify your pineal gland, right? You only use, I forget what the percentage you do, is. You do what? What y'all what? Decalcify your pineal gland. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, let me see if let me see if anybody. You got a couple of your viewers on here, so they probably... Somebody tell you what this man somebody say, D, do some your Panera gland. Somebody... I ain't said nothing about no Panera bread, dude. <laughs> somebody... I'm going to see if somebody know on here. Since you tag... Hold on, somebody trying to come in. Oh. Uh, he going to get on your bumper. He can be talking shit. Yeah, my boy. You know my boy going to be talking shit. Joe, what? What's wrong with you, bro? <laughs> Man, what's wrong with you, bro? What's wrong with you, bro? Ain't nothing wrong with me, man. Man, them plants make you shit like you eat dairy. That's what I'm talking about. You're a stomach fucked up with the dairy product. The plants make you do the same thing. No, no, they don't. The, the plants, what the plants do is they clean out your body. And this is a proven fact. You still scientific. gonna take a shit, this right? Is, this you is still science. gonna take a shit, right? This is scientific. We ain't talking about. We talking about sickness and cleansing your body. Like you I can, cleansed it when I went got in the bathtub. I, I'm not. I'm not asking what you believe. I'm not asking what you believe is true. Scientifically, we can prove this. You know what I'm saying? So you're not coming with a scientific argument. Hang up on him. <laughs> nah, nah. Mm -mm. Hang up on my boy. <laughs> Hey, look, nah, uh, say, bro. How could someone, bro? Like you talking about eating? some? You finna stop eating plants and drink and drink some fluids and and charge up on the sun. What the fuck is wrong with you? Hey, we got we got people that need help. How I hang up on him? Bro? I just X out the screen now. There we go. Right. <laughs> How could someone like be overweight start eating like this? Because I know. You just can't start overnight. So how how did you start? Also, okay, so basically, right, um, you got to understand this, right? Yo, you, your stomach is a muscle, right? The more you use it, the more it's going to stretch out. The more you don't you, because a lot of people, they be like, oh, I can't do that. Ooh, ooh, I, you know what I'm saying? My eating habits, but they eating habits. Food is a drug, just like... It's just like with anything, like you put a drug in your body, it goes into your blood or goes in your stomach, breaks down in your stomach, breaks down in your blood and, and sends messages up to your brain. Food does the same exact thing. It's a drug. So really, you got an addiction. We all got food addictions. We don't got bad eating habits. We got food addictions because it's a drug. <coughs> so you got to cut things out. One, well, That's how I did. I cut things out one by one. I never really ate pork. Um... Um, but I cut beef out when I cut beef out after that I cut chicken out after chicken I cut fish out huh? Oh. Uh, after that I cut fish out and then I cut dairy out dairy was the last thing because dairy believe it or not dairy is just as as addicting as um, cocaine and you can you can research this um um so you, you just got to take steps. You can't do it all overnight. You know what I'm saying? Some people can, but, but you, you, you really got to you, you gotta take it step by step. 
Hey, I got people on here telling you I'm speaking the truth. Hey, look, look, look. Nah, I ain't saying you lying. I was just finna come address that. I'm not saying you lying, bro, but <laughs> what I'm saying is ain't nothing wrong with the people that's eating like we eating. Top, top funny as hell to my old smart ass nigga. <laughs> ain't nothing wrong. Ain't nothing wrong with eating like how we eat. You know what I'm saying? With the ones that eating Harold's and Uncle Remus and jerk chicken and, and soul food. You feel me? That's why they call it soul food. It's good for your soul. You see what I'm saying? Mm -mm. That's why they call it soul food. You feel? So that's what I'm saying. I ain't saying what you saying wrong. I think, I think I'm just saying you ain't telling you. You just made my point. You say all this stuff bogus. Bogus basically. If that's why you gonna stop eating. Yeah. Cause all of us bogus. So it's, it's getting to that point. It's getting, it's getting to that point where you are gonna stop eating food. Period. Yeah. So okay, you eating vegan food, but you saying in a way it's bogus. It's it's going. It's getting there. So now, and then, but and you I'm smoke take, rum rock now, or now, ten rocks, you still smoking rock. It's not there yet. It's not there yet. Now right now you can identify right. right. So right now I don't um right now I don't eat hybrid uh, vegetables, fruits and vegetables. So. And this takes a lot of research, you know what I'm saying? So even like the things that you grew up on and you you've been accustomed to your whole life, like he the says, gonna take your soul. The regular bananas, <laughs> right? Oh, so you got a whole little coat following. Hold on, you got a whole little coat. Who is this? <laughs> Who is this? Josh Fox. Look, I'm gonna bring my niggas. You bring your niggas. You feel me? <laughs> and we gonna see. You feel me? So, so like right. the, the regular, the regular bananas, I don't, I don't eat the regular bananas because you gotta understand the history of the banana. They really, they, they made it. Um, what they did with the banana was they made a hybrid, and basically they made it easy for people to peel the banana because the the original banana or the alkaline banana in its original state is not easily peeled. It it is not it's not um as soft, um, and the, the actual banana that you eat is acidic to your body. Your body's supposed to be at a certain pH level, you know what I'm saying? And these hybrid vegetables. Boom, bro! What you want? So, ah. hey, look though, I hard not you with that shit too, bro. Hi, uh, now you with this? You with this? No food shit, bro. Who else with this shit? Well, my fuck, go ahead, man. Yeah, so, so people that want to, some people that do want to hear this <laughs> crazy shit. <laughs> so, so you got you, you got to really do your research and find out what, like, if you really do your research, you are gonna find out only nuts this. Phoebe said thank you too, by the way. She said she gonna try. Oh, it. oh you up. Only um nuts that 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 are, are not um hybrid or acidic to the body. Dominique, shut your uh, ass up. Y'all playing. Uh, now y'all wanna play on here. <laughs> what what they say? <laughs> <laughs> now you talk about no meat, Dominique fat ass. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> now they wanna play you. They gonna talk crazy, cause I know. <laughs> oh, that's all you know I gotta eat eat all everything. It sound this shit sound amazing to me. Don't get me wrong. I'm with it. I'm with all this this new age shit that's going on. <laughs> more power to the people. You know what I'm saying? But you ain't just gonna be telling me no anything and I'm like, ah right, yeah, yeah, yeah. When you sitting up there telling me vegan food bad too. So what you just say that's your uh pre yeah, nah, preference. Just say that's your preference. Nah, that. Don't be looking at my food, cause it's all he looking at my food crazy. Here's, here's my fried you, chicken. Don't you look at my food? Here, now here's where you're right. Here's where you got a good point at because people think going vegan they automatically are going to be healthy. But a lot of these hybrid vegetables rob you of your minerals and, they, and they're acidic. So instead of healing you, they actually still hurt you. So cauliflower, broccoli, you want to stay away from them. Carrots, it's, it's, and, and it's, so, it's, it's so many different fruits and vegetables. Um, you just got to really do your research on what's original, what God created. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? When I say God, I mean nature. Um, um, because other than that, you know what I'm saying, it's it's, it's uh, acidic and poisonous to your, to your body. And then another thing, too, when people go vegan, right, they don't understand that what they, another thing they do is they put a lot of soy, like these different vegan restaurants, even at like 
a lot of vegan recipes or um, things you could buy at the grocery store, they got a lot of soy in them, right? You really want to stay away from soy because soy has um, hormones and now that it has added hormones to it. And when I say hormones, it has uh, estrogen, yeah, right? Estrogen. So as a man, right, man or woman, right, you don't want to consume because your body had produces enough of every hormone, just like milk. Milk got added hormones. So with women, like yo, know, it it it'll affect depending on the person. Person to person is different. It could affect your moods, your cycle. When your cycle hit, it could be more intense. You know what I'm saying? You consuming these um, toxic foods. That's it. Yeah, I'm done. G. I'm done. G. What? I'm going too deep. G. Y'all. Nah, know. nah. Yeah, nah. We, we, all over the place. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> See. I can go for days, so that's one up for the goddamn it, the meat lovers. No, no homo. That's one up for the chicken lovers and the and the and the sauce, cause you don't you don't eat it's the sauce bad too, huh? Sweet rice bread, that's bad for you. It depends. It, it, most, yes, because the sugar that they put in there, it probably has artificial preservatives. Um, yeah. Ketchup. Depends. Ketchup can ketchup is really supposed to be tomatoes, it is. water, and um um if they can if they can get around putting the vinegar in it, you know what I'm saying? Damn you bogus as hell, boy, your ass is sitting over here flexing on the internet. What do you, what do you say? Only food that's earth grown, so that's how he <laughs> Hey you might you might have switched it up. I can't handle this goddamn Facebook shit, bro. Motherfucker, <laughs> stunning on this bitch. Ain't gonna be keeping it real, G. We ain't gonna be doing he might, this. He might have switched it up. Ain't, ain't no telling. Man. Oh, and another, another thing too, right? I, he said he was done. Yeah, I was. I said I was done. I lied. L listen, so right. Another thing too, people automatically they they go vegan and assume they go vegan in order to lose weight, right? So, um. You will lose weight, but you have to cut out bread and um, pastas because technically, you know, grain um, pastas and breads that have grain um, are technically vegan, but um, they still that that still goes straight to your stomach and your and. Your, your body can't naturally break down that wheat, so it just sits in your stomach. And then by it sitting in your stomach, it becomes toxic. Any excess weight in your stomach becomes toxic. So if your body can't break it down and get it out, it's going to become toxic. So you have to stop. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Give me one bacon wrap rib any day. I don't eat pork, but I'm with, I'm with that shit right there, my nigga. Yeah. Any day. Man, this nigga might say some more wild shit, so I might have to log back on this one. He be saying some wild shit, man. He finna stop eating food. I ain't never heard no shit like that a day before in my life, ever. Never. I done met some crazy. I done been in Dixon and with, with a whole psych ward. And I ain't never even heard them play no crazy shit like that, so. Ain't no telling what this nigga might come up with, man. But I'm about it, man.